Hey there guys, Nathan here with another Minigolf VR work in progress video. So in this one there's a couple of new changes. One is this ball mark that we can see here. Basically yeah, it shows you where the ball is, pretty handy. And the second one is that the second course is now completely finished and I'll basically be giving you guys a full walkthrough of it. So let's begin. Here we are at hole one. It's basically simple teleportation. Getting people into the swing of things. Brain. Hole two is um, teleportation with some zero gravity. So if we hit this straight, which that looks reasonably straight, we can see that the ball travels all the way through and it ends up behind us here. And then we can just tap the and brain. Hole 3. Hole 3 is basically our... Where am I? Let's go from here. Hole 3 is playing with um, alternate gravity. So here we can see that we can hit things up onto the walls if we hit hard enough. Which there we go. And then we'll just tap that through. Oh, and it goes in. Brilliant. Hole four. Let's make sure I'm facing the right way. Awesome. Alright, so with this one we have a bit of everything so far. So we have teleporters leading into a zero gravity area. And then basically it runs into these three teleporters and whichever one it goes into determines where it ends up. So in this case it looks like it goes through there, which takes us here. Alright, so I can go around here. Playing on the roof is much more difficult than you think it would be. Awesome. So, let's jump to hole five. This one is basically um, everything except the zero graph, but it plays with a new concept, and I'll show you once we get to it. I'll just hit that out of there, and nice little bug, awesome. Too far. So, I'm going to basically do a misplay for you guys, just to show off something. First I'm going to try and get this over the damn thing. Really? Why are you hitting? I know what's going on there. Alright, so basically yeah, we can see it goes through that teleporter, and then it'll come out here. Basically means you fucked up. But, if we go over here, we can see that if we oh, go a bit closer, we can hit this with our golf club, and bam. Now that teleport is active, and this one here isn't. And that will propagate through multiplayer, so if someone's trying to take a shot, you can sort of whack that, and then it'll fuck up where their ball goes. And that's sort of the start of our PvP elements that I'm working on. I don't... I'm I think I'd be better at this by now with the amount of times I've done it, but no. Alright, so now we can just hit this across, ends up over here, and then we can just hit it in. Oh, really? And then, awesome. Only 25 shots, not bad. Alright, hole 6 is basically a timing challenge with this rotating portal that we've got. So what I can do is first get to the right spot and that there. Oh, yeah. Not quite where we want it. Let's try that again. Nope. That'll do. Nope, that went too far. Brilliant. I'm so good at this. 
That's something. Alright. Well, we go through eventually. basically a sort of strength challenge sort of thing, so you can see that if we hit it through there hard enough, it should end up there. So let's see how we go. Oh, not quite. Let's give it one more shot. No, that went too far. You also have to hit it straight, which is quite difficult when you're playing with one hand. Alright, let's just play from here. We have to hit it up here. Oh, so close. Fun fact, I did have these as curves not that long ago, and then I got to there and I hit it down, and it went all the way down. So I almost shot someone, and that's why these are square now. Basically a sort of skill challenge thing as well, so if I jump to here you'll see we have this portal and we've got a small gap to get it in, and basically if you get it in then congrats, you'll make it to the hole, if you don't then you're going the long way around. And we got it in in this case, luckily, and that went straight in, brilliant. Right, last hole is hole 9. Um, this one you can see we've got a, um, this part of the station is destroyed, and as you can guess we have zero gravity here. So, let's go over here to the ball. Oh. Yeah, we've got seven different slots to try and get the ball through. Looks like we went pretty straight there. Alright. We didn't pick the best way to go, but it's better than nothing. And we're in. Alright, so that's all nine holes of mini golf. Basically, for my next thing, I will be um, working on the PvP course, which is basically um, having player controlled hazards that go through multiplayer. So someone could say hit a ball and you could activate a windmill or something and it'll whoop, and yeah it'll sort of blow their ball away, which would be pretty cool I think. Um, yeah, basically I think PvP is going to be a pretty fun mode in mini golf. We'll sort of see how it turns out. But anyway, apart from that, that's it for this video. So I'll catch you folks later.